If you're also struggling to dress in the heat, I hope this video will give you some tips from head to toe. Starting from your hair, I pretty much never let my hair down when it's hot or when I know that I'm gonna be sweating a lot. And instead of putting it in a ponytail, which I feel like sometimes doesn't go with the vibes of more dressier or more elegant outfits, I've recently been really, really into hair cloths. I talked about these hair cloths in my latest favorites video I'm wearing the pearl one right now they are super affordable they do the job in pulling your hair in the back just give you a very clean start I think the key with dressing in the heat is you need to feel clean and cool and chic to almost giving off that cool vibe like quite literally but also from a fashion sense as well carrying on with the clean look i always have some sort of watery moisturizer so this is the neutrogena hydro boost i've gone through truly countless bottles of this it just has the best watery texture it is just so lightweight easily absorbed by your skin and it really works well with your light makeup especially during the summertime you just don't want your face to feel like there are a lot of products piling on top so in terms of my base i've also talked about this in my favorites video just go for some really simple concealer i have the glossier stretch concealer Many days I just use this concealer to somewhat fix the discoloration. I don't even mind if you know you can see the pimple spot here or some of the hyperpigmentation. This stretch concealer really gives you that no makeup makeup effect. Last beauty item I'll talk about is something like a multi-use lip and cheek product. So this is from Bloom Effect. Again, mentioned it in my favorites video. This is their tulip tint in the shade crispa coral it has a really balmy consistency i'm actually wearing it on my cheeks right now it's subtle but it's also buildable you can also apply it on your lips so i really love the two-in-one effect of this product again you can go really minimum with just a simple concealer and a blush slash lip product and you're pretty much good to go in terms of outfits i would recommend going for breathable materials like linen or cotton as opposed to something like a polyester so as you can see the sheer top even though it looks very sheer and you would assume that it'll be extremely breathable and everything but it is made of this polyester material so when i compare this with a very similar white top but made of cotton i actually would rather wear this cotton white top because it actually makes me feel a little bit more breathable on the skin i've always been obsessed with linen especially when it's hot outside again linen is a material that is almost weaved in a more loose matter than cotton so it's gonna just make your skin feel even more breathable and linen is a material that the more you wash it the softer it gets so i would highly recommend if you can invest in linen pieces because they will truly last you for years and years the next tip might be counterintuitive but in the heat i actually recommend covering more rather than less so using something like a very long loose linen pants versus your denim shorts is actually going to protect you from the heat because it gives you the coverage so your skin isn't exposed under the sun under the heat but it's also loose enough that your skin can still breathe especially in breathable material like linen another example is comparing something like a tank top versus a more loose fitted oversized t-shirt even though this t-shirt has more fabric than the tank top by the way i love them both they're both from h&m um, the tank top does show off more of the skin especially if you know that you'll be exposed under the sun i would actually recommend for 
a more looser fit t-shirt and in terms of the color of the clothing you'll notice that all of the pieces that I just showed you are all in the lighter shades and I think this is something that you've probably heard many times go for something that is lighter shade versus a darker shade like black because darker colors attract the heat so if you are walking under the sun you will actually feel hotter wearing a black t-shirt versus a light colored t-shirt the next tip is my favorite which is to find clothing that allow you to go braless i don't know if you can tell but i'm not wearing a bra right now and i've actually talked about specific tricks to look for when it comes to finding pieces that don't require a bra so something with ruching in the front will be really helpful in just concealing and the benefit of this is essentially you are reducing another layer of clothing when it's really hot i really just i don't like wearing bras in general and especially when it's super hot it just does not make sense to me i literally pulled this from my wash but this is my favorite piece gifted to me by Hilera. I've actually talked a lot about Hilera pieces in my past videos. They just have the best, most functional yet stylish clothing. So pretty much all of my pieces from Hilera have built-in bra pads and that just reduce that other layer of bra and also the material of this particular dress from Hilera it pretty much has a cooling effect so if you can look for materials that almost have a cooling effect Uniqlo also sells some blocking kind of zip up hoodies so look for materials that will either keep your skin cool or help prevent the sun damage in terms of accessories i think the no-brainer is to wear a hat and i used to hate bucket hats but ever since i got this one from primark i just really love how cute it is i mean i'm wearing a hair cloth so you can't see i can't even put it on fully on my head but it makes me look cute and also helps block the sun and my current favorite is actually this one that i got from amazon it's kind of like a hiking hat in the sense that there is mesh lining to help reduce the sweat there's also even a ponytail hole to you know put your hair out which is really helpful and you can tie a cute little bow there's also this detachable strap to help secure um, the hat on your head and I love how wide the rim is and you can even just you know wear a hat like this if you are walking around and don't feel like you need the hat at that second so i just feel like the design details of this particular sun hat is super helpful it also has i think upf 50 which essentially is the equivalent of spf in sunscreen so it does help prevent you from the sun and it also folds up very small so really really handy definitely remember to wear a hat especially when the sun is just beating down on you you know i love my jewelry but in the very hot weather i actually try to stay away from things like necklaces or layering necklaces first of all if you wear gold vermeil or gold plated necklaces they will tarnish if you sweat a lot so i just stop wearing them in the hot hot summer days but you can still accessorize with your earrings because they're not really touching any part of your skin but the piercing part so they don't really add additional heat but they make your outfit look still very put together you don't have to sacrifice style to keep yourself from the heat i also love that even with the beaded detail it almost feels a bit more summery and cooling and don't forget your handbags because even though your handbags aren't directly touching your skin i feel like when you're wearing something like a nylon handbag or a rope detail or canvasy handbag it just visually makes your outfit look a bit more cooling and i don't know psychologically i just feel a bit cooler carrying handbags with just lighter materials moving down to shoes i've worn this pair of vivaya sneakers for almost a year now pretty much non-stop and i especially love wearing these when the weather is hot sometimes i feel like if i'm just wearing sandals my the back of my feet still feel really really hot so sometimes i'd rather 
wear sneakers that are extremely breathable but I'm also in the meantime preventing my feet from getting burned from the sun. Leave in the comments below what your tips in dressing for the heat for the hot summer season and I will see you in one of these ones. Bye!